I've played a heap of horror games throughout my time, and there's nothing more scarier than the reality of being squashed to death. In Cockroach Simulator, that could very well happen. Made by HFM Games and released in late 2016, the game has you play either a man trying to protect his kitchen from a cockroach infestation, or you play a cockroach itself just trying to eat food and lay eggs whilst trying to avoid the house owner's attacks. As the cockroach, you can run up walls and it's pretty confusing at first. As the house owner, you have to keep an eye on all the walls and the floor, and also pick up objects to kill the cockroaches. On paper, this sounds pretty stupid, and it is. But man, is this game fun to play when you are with friends. The first time I loaded this up, it was with Val, and a lot of giggles were had. He then told Cameron about it, he bought it, and then jumped online. Oh, there you are, man. <laughs> are you both on top of the fucking? <laughs> You're both on top of it, aren't you? No. Oh my god, Matt. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> You're done, mate. <laughs> yes, he lives. <laughs> A few moments later. Oh. Nice. Ah, fuck! Yes! <laughs> fuck! <laughs> Do you have a gun? Where are you? What is that? That's a gun! What are you <laughs> fucking shotgun? <laughs> <laughs> As if you're gonna kill me with a fucking shotgun, you psycho! Whoa! Okay. As you can see, this game is pretty damn fun with mates, but in order to be a fair game, you actually need to play with more players. The more cockroaches playing, the more food will be spawned. When it's a small number of players, it's more intense and slower due to the small amount of food that is scattered around the kitchen. When you play with more people, crumbs are literally scattered everywhere. So what did we do? We went over to the American servers and played a few rounds there. People were delivering babies left, right and centre. When five babies are delivered, the cockroaches win. If the house owner kills all the cockroaches, then they win. It's a pretty simple system. And whilst it was more fun when it was just us playing ourselves, I would imagine with several more of our friends, it would have been a really, really fun game in larger numbers. There is no story or campaign if you are for some reason looking for one. This is purely a multiplayer game. The game currently costs $6 on Steam and whilst it's a fantastic time, I can recommend you pick this one up for half that price. You can easily get 2-3 to three hours of fun before you've played enough of it. But apart from that, pick this one up, play it with your friends, it's a really great time. If you like what you've seen here and you want to see more, hit the like and sub button. Come over and say hi at our Steam Curator page, I'll leave a link in the description below. This is Shawnee Maurice from HiHoo, thanks for watching.